Hi guys! Hello! Good evening! And welcome! Greetings pop pickers! Hello rap fans! Whew! What a day! Busy old day today! Right, who's out there today? We're logging on? We're getting stuck in? Or have I killed you off last night? If I'm the only one doing this session, I'm going to be pretty miffed. Marco's in the building. All right, here he is. Okay, buddy. Give me a thumbs up. Hey, dude. Mon chéri. Comment ça va? Ça va bien? Zut alors. Welcome to the madhouse. Um, okay. Right, exactly the same as normal. Same rules apply. Make sure nothing's around you you can fall off and hurt yourself on. Make sure you've got a drink. Make sure you've got a towel. Make sure that you don't feel unwell. If you do, don't do it. If you start to feel unwell, jump off. Go tell somebody. Look after yourself. Keep smiling. Be happy. Right, tonight it's called the Asylum. I've had a mad, crazy day. Absolutely off the charts day. I've had phone calls and emails from some incredible people. Thanks, uh, thanks to uh, all the people that phoned me today and reached out and offered me a little bit of hope. It's been amazing. Thank you so much. I've offered some unbelievably kind offers, some really nice feedback from people about the work we're doing and stuff. So, yeah, thanks to those guys. If you watch this. It's been really, really nice to know that you're supporting us. Um, I've also had the kids, who've been amazing. But, you know, six and seven year olds, so they're bonkers. Uh, I've been sorting out the garden. I've been trimming a tree. I've been, like, you name it. You name it. It's one of those days. Made the dinner. Did the lunch. Ooh, it's all the things that you have to do when you become a grown-up. I've trimmed my beard. Still couldn't decide about the hair. I was going to chop the hair off and I thought, well, I might leave it another few days. So I'm not sure. But anyway, right, so tonight's called the Asylum. So we're doing our five minute warm up, same as normal, of which we're already halfway through. At eight o'clock, we have to stop and do the applause for the NHS guys. We have to stop, but we have to basically applaud. So if we're halfway through a little sprint, we have to basically sprint and clap. I don't know how we're going to do it, but we'll figure it out. Um, but. The reason this is called the asylum is because I just had one of those days where loads of crazy stuff happened. So I'm going to do exactly the same thing here. So we're going to do this five minute warm up. Then at the end of this two minutes that we've got left, we are going to do another five minutes of warm up. And you can choose, because I don't want people moaning at me that I'm being too hard on you. So you can choose what we do. So you can either go up a gear every minute. So make sure you're in a nice low gear to start with. Or you can go up and make it a bit harder, so spin a bit faster. You have to be honest. If you really can't be bothered, you don't have to do either. You can just do the same thing. But what we're doing is we're going to go one gear. We're going to add one gear on or go a bit faster every minute for five minutes. Okay? So by the end of that five minutes, you might have just gone a gear higher every minute. Or you might have gone a gear higher, then spun a bit faster, then gone a bit higher. It's up to you. Okay, whatever combination you want. And then, after that five minutes is up, we begin absolute lunacy. So, everything's 30 seconds. 30 seconds left leg, 30 seconds right leg, 30 seconds standing, 30 seconds sprinting. Each one's got 30 seconds in between rest, and we're gonna do that thing five times. 20 minutes, and then it's all done, and then nice long warm down, cool down. Whole session, 40 minutes. That's it. 40 minutes. Asylum means a safe place. This is your safe place, Mark. I want you to feel loved and warm and fuzzy. You are great. Everybody loves you. If I find out that you sat down in the standing up bits though, we're done. We're finished. You're no friend of mine. <laughs> All right, so if you can't do it, same as always, sit down, spin it out, take it down a gear. Don't be crazy. But have some fun with it, okay? If you need to miss a bit out, miss a bit out. Right, so in 10 seconds, you can choose. You can go up a gear, or you can spin faster. It's up to you. Ready? 
I'm going up again. Go. Okay, so one minute in the slightly bigger gear. Whoa, we yeah, what a day. Oh yeah, by the way, I didn't tell you what t-shirt I'm wearing today. I know it's the highlight of everybody's day. This cycling's is reversed, isn't it? So this cycling's is uh, the balance bike program that we run here in North Somerset, Bristol, the southwest of England. And we've been working closely with uh, some schools around the country and with the Department for International Trade about selling these balance bike kits to schools around the world. Around the world! Me! No, old me! In my shed! So yeah, it's exciting. So it's kind of brought it a bit forward now we're at home all day. He's got lots of time to plan it and do loads of work and all the finishing touches. Right, in five seconds it's going to change. You're going to speed up, we're going to go up a gear. I'm going up a gear. Okay, go, change. Right. Yeah, so we, uh, we are going to hopefully be selling these kits around the world. So we can get all these awesome kids learning to ride for the first time using the cycling scheme. So it helps the teachers out. All the planning is done for them, all the assessments, all those amazing things. Uh, there are activities the kids can do in class. Um, if it's a rainy day, kids they can, um, sorry, there's things they can do on the computer. So I've got a couple of apps built where the kids can interact. They can drag the parts of the bike into a, a slider game. They can also um, do like a, an actual physical writing version. So teachers can print out resources where kids can cut out the parts of a bike and they can label them up or the kids can write them in the box. So there's loads of different cognitive things they can do. Hang on. Three, two, one, change. I'm changing gear. Uh, yeah, so cycling is an awesome scheme. All built around the characteristics of effective learning, which is essentially the kind of national curriculum for reception in year one kids, preschool. So yeah, we've kind of been given the green light to sell that around the world. So cyclings .co.uk red is the trademark no stealing my idea people <laughs> so it's going to be good right 30 seconds how are we feeling you can tell I'm in a crazy mood today right it's going to be a good session Guy Bradford is in the house Guy are you actually on the bike give me a thumbs up if you're on the bike if you're having a beer by the way I know Guy's a big fan of Corona so I think you're doing all right. You have cut price Corona for the next couple of months at least. Right, three, two, one. I'm going to go a bit faster this time. I'm going to pick my pace up. That's quite a big gear. A minute of that. Don't get crazy. We're still just warming up, really. Here we go. Ah, good. So last night after the session. I tweeted the guys from Bristol Butter, telling them that they were the stars of our session. And guess what? They didn't come out to me. <laughs> you were expecting me to have a whole load of uh, free Bristol Butter then, weren't you? No. Nah. Nothing, not even a retweet. Not even a good job, guys. All this free session for people in lockdown. You deserve a knighthood. Nothing. Whew. Right. Two. One. I'm changing gear. Change. Ugh. Big mistake. I've gone too early. Whoa. I didn't drink enough last night. I felt terrible this morning. Didn't follow my own advice. Got to make sure I get there liquid in tonight after the session. You'll be glad to know though, I didn't eat any meat last night. Cut my own tea, pasta, veggies, oh delicious. The only problem with being a vegan, vegan cheese. Uh, someone could invent decent vegan cheese, you are quids in. If I like to do one, it's sort of all right. Make sure cook it, spread it on top. But other than that, oh, horrific. Right, five, four, three, two, spin it, 
down. Easy gear. Couple of minutes. Guy. Yes, I'm on my bike. What a legend. What a legend. Guy, can I tell you a story to everyone? I'm telling them anyway. So this time last year, Guy got sepsis, died on the way to hospital. Came back to life. Now it's back to running. What a hero. That is a super abbreviated version of that story. But I went running with him last week. He made me work for it. He's got a bionic heart now. Some carbon fiber valves. He's on his bike tonight. What a hero. He's still annoying. He's still the loudest man in the world. <laughs> but he's a legend. Good to have you with us, buddy. Right, one more minute of this rest. And then we go into the craziness. The crazy. Okay, so remember, 30 seconds, left leg only, 30 seconds rest. 30 seconds right leg only, 30 seconds rest. 30 seconds standing up, 30 seconds rest, 30 seconds sprint. If that's too hard, <clears throat> just make it 15 seconds of each and have 45 seconds of rest. If that's too hard, Frankly, haven't you been watching for the last two weeks? These are pretty tough, these sessions, eh? I'm not supposed to be at that, it's supposed to be for everyone, but people don't believe me when I say they're for beginners and they won't take it easy. They watch me doing it and spin it fast, think they need to do the same thing. Which you don't. If you're joining in, just do it at your pace, do what you can. Right, so 10 seconds. We're gonna do 30 seconds left leg only. For those of you who have two legs and aren't sure which is which, it's the left one. Glad that cleared it up. Okay, left leg, let's go. Whee! Oh, you do the trick like where you make an L with your finger. If any of you are actually doing the right leg now, I might have to disown you. Whew. Don't panic if you've just realized you are. That's fine. Three, two, one, both feet. Clip in, no messing. Straight in tonight. Little down. 30 seconds of both. Then we're doing right leg. Don't forget we're doing this five times through. Yeah, five times through. I've realized I haven't put my light on, so I might get dark in a minute. I might have to get off and put a light on if you can't see me. Right, five seconds. Right leg, three, two, one, right leg only, pushing and pulling, and get the rhythm smooth, no clunking, no rocking around on your bike, cheating, legs straight up and down, big pistons, building up those big leg muscles, good job team, 10 more seconds, let's go, Three, two, one. Feet on. Good. Right, standing. In 30 seconds, we're standing. If you need to put it in a bigger gear, do so. If you can do it in a smaller gear and just spin a bit faster, do so. Whatever you want. Remember, as Mark Hopkins says, this is your safe place. It's okay. Just have fun. Keep smiling. Keep having some fun. Right, ready? Two, one, stand, let's go. Woo! Good job, guys. I feel all American now. Woo, yeah! Let's go! How long was that? 15. Good. Well, the fifth one of these isn't going to be very much fun. 25. Three, two, one, sit down, relax, take the weight off, ready for a sprint, and then with one sticky takedown. Oh, one just fell off, so that's handy. Okay, good job, team. Uh, I'll tell you about another call I got earlier as well in a minute. Right, sprint, ready? Two, 
Well, let's go, sprint. Remember, I've got five of these, they don't sprint, sprint. You know what I mean, just go a little bit faster. Focus on the technique. Tackers is the most important bit. Just raise that tempo. Keep it high. 10 more seconds. Woo. Yeah. Five. Three. One. And easy. Good. That's one lap for it. It's easy, right? Good job, guys. Okay, so back to left leg now. We know what we're doing. Okay, so my story from today. I don't hold me to this. Left leg, let's go. Don't hold me to this. But I've been talking to a couple of companies about them coming on board to sponsor a professional cycling team based in Bristol. Sounds glam, right? It's going to be ace if it comes off. So we've got to define pro. All right, keep going. Three seconds. Two, one. Both feet on. Good. Ooh, ooh, hang on. Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Missed it. Oh, terrible. Right. Yeah. So um, we're looking at do we do like an under 23 team and enter the eventually in three years time into the national series, the British Grand Prix. Um, or do we just make it like a regional one for elites in category one riders? Okay, right leg guys, ready, go. But essentially, to all intents and purposes, we'll be set up as a professional team with me as the boss. We've got uh, promises of a couple of cars and we've got the van, which will be liveried up and we will attend regional races and we will have a team of guys going in, and girls, we want a girls team as well, and trying to do their best, win some races. Right, that's 30 seconds, both feet on. So, the details aren't fully there yet, but I'm excited about what could happen. So do we partner up with the college, the university, and actually run it as like a course, so the kids can get an education as well? Or do we do it for grown-ups like me, who? I missed the boat in terms of becoming a pro rider, but still want to race at high level. Okay, we're standing up. Three, two, one, let's go. I'm going to pull it up a couple of gears. I find it hard standing up if I don't have it in a big gear. All right, good, guys. Excellent. Hi, Jason Williams. Yes, mate. Mark Hopkins, you are right, it is going to be awesome. It's probably only, let's call it a 50 50 chance at the moment. Okay, good, sit down. Um, yeah, we're talking to three or four different groups to try and bring this all together. But, and I was trying to plan it for a couple of years' time, if I'm honest, but with everything that's going on, I'm hoping that we can get some funding for it bring it forward. That will become kind of my part-time job on top of all the kids stuff. Right, sprinting, ready? Okay. Go. 30 seconds hard. Oh, take this out of gear. Don't need too high gear like me. Silly boy. Good. Get those legs rolling. Keep your body still. Yeah. Good. Last ten. Three, two, one. Sweet. I'm taking it down again. That's too hard. Oh dear. Well, that's two rounds done. Three to go. Squeezy peasy, right? Oh. Not really. I told you it was called the, the crazy, the sunglass. Okay, three, two, 
One, left leg only, remember we're back to the start. So left leg, right leg, standing sprint. That's the four sessions, or the four elements of the session, shall I say. Really focus on your technique. Push, pull, push, pull. Oh yeah. Good guys. Nice day in England today. Sun was out. Not too hot, not too cold. Okay, both feet. Yeah, lovely day. I trimmed my tree. I pollarded my tree. I didn't get crazy. I didn't chop everything off. There's a nest in there, you see. I didn't want to disturb the birds. It's nice to have nesting birds in the garden. It's taken us a few years to kind of encourage them in. We don't want to lose them now. Right. Five, four, three, two, one. Right leg. Good. Yeah, so if anyone out there knows any big companies, I want to get their name out there, sponsor something amazing, so they can sponsor the pro team and come and ride in the car with us at the big races and come and go out for rides with the pro team and have them come to their workplace and give a talk on healthy lifestyles and whatnot. And they can also be sponsoring all the work we do in schools. So, both feet on guys, both feet. A couple of thousand kids every year going through our sessions in schools. Another few hundred doing community activities in places around Bristol. So if you know a Bristol company who needs to put their name to something really positive, this could be it. Okay, stand in, so bigger gear if you need it. Three, two, one, up we go. Good guys. We're over halfway through. We're doing well. Keep it going, kidders. It's gone so dark I can't see my watch now. 20 seconds. Last 10. Last 5. 3, 2, 1. Sit down. Good job. Pick it down a couple of gears if you went up. Don't get too low. we sprinting this time, remember? Okay. Start to lift up a little bit so there's not too much of a shock. 10 seconds time. We're going into our sprint. Five, three, two, one, let's go. Let's get some power down. It's only 30 seconds, let's go. You can only do 15. Do 15, make them quality though. That's your 15 if you're dropping out now, that's fine. Let's have a longer rest. We're doing it all again in a minute. If you're still with me, that's 25. Two, one, one. Good job. That's our third round, guys. It's getting really dark, isn't it? It's good for you guys. You can't see me as well. I look really handsome in the dark. Okay, left leg, guys. Three, two, one, let's go. Left leg only. Good. This is where your technique's going to start to go. Don't let it. Concentrate on the pulling. Big, long, circly circles. No shortcutting, making them into little tiny squares. Big circles. If you're in your big ring, you've got 52 teeth chain ring on, you're going to be able to use all of it. There's no point pushing that big gear, not being able to use it. Okay, feet on. Excellent. Oh yeah. You guys can only see me getting gradually darker, but just over your head, I can see what's turning into a rather magnificent sunset. Oh, we do get some winning sunsets in WSN. Right, right leg guys. Three, two, 
one, let's go. If it's getting too much, just keep spinning for one. Or just do short, just do 10 seconds. Just keep smiling. It'll be fine. I've done some research and no one's legs have ever actually fallen off from cycling, even though they felt like they were gonna. Whew. But just be careful, okay? If it's too much, back it right on. Two, one, both feet on. Good, what's next guys, can you remember? That's right, standing. Good job. I'm gonna angle my watch, see if I can still see it when I'm standing up. <sighs> right, 10 seconds to go. I have to promise to myself I'd have a drink, I haven't had one yet. Silly boy. Three, two, one, stand, let's go. Add a couple of gears and it makes life easier. Give yourself some resistance to work with. Good work guys. Keep it going. That's halfway. Whew. Actually standing this time feels alright for the first 15 seconds. 28, 29, sit down. Take it off a couple of gears if you need to. Whew. Right now we got the sprint. I'm going to put my light on after this one. Right, 10 seconds. Start to lift it so it's not too much of a shock. Three, two, one, let's go hard. Grit your teeth. There's only one more round to go. Let's go. Come on, guys. Push, push, push. That's halfway. Come on. Remember you're pulling. Don't get lazy with the technique. This is when it counts. Twenty-nine. Thirty. Good job. I'm gonna switch my light on. Oh yeah. There you go. Oh, you can see me. That's what I look like. I've got a bit of gold tape stuck to my leg now. Right. Oh, there you are. Hello, everyone. Okay. Last round. Throw the budget put light on. Yeah, Marco, that's what I've done. Right, let's go, left leg. 50 p's in the meter. So my budget for making these films is largely proportionate with how much I'm asking you to pay for them. So no light. You just have to figure the rest out for yourself. Right, you can't see what I'm doing, but I promise you I really am standing up and going as hard as I can. Honest. <laughs> Would I lie to you guys? Right, here we go. Feet on. 30 seconds, 30 seconds of that. That's our last round, remember? So a maximum effort on these. I'm going up a gear. Yeah, let's have it. Whoa. Crazy day, huh? Crazy day. Good day. Right. Right leg. Let's go. Whoa. I've got one gear too high. Let's keep it going. Big circles. Good job, guys. Hello. Hi. Oh, to the clap. To the clap. Okay, after this one, we're doing our NHS clap gang. That's my beautiful wife reminding me that we should do it. 28, 29, 30, right, both feet on, hands off. Let's give my clap. If you're working in the hospital now, like my neighbours are, like my next door neighbours and across the way, good job. I personally think we're heroes every day. Right, thank you anyway. If you're a delivery driver, if you're working in the supermarket like my mother-in-law, keep it going. Thanks to everyone who's staying doing all these things while we're on lockdown. 
Well done everyone. Right, let's stand up, go. I'm going to punish, punish Mark for all his unkind words he's texted me. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Can we manage to stand on a sprint? We've got any more in the tank? 10 seconds left, let's go. Five. Let's go. Two. Oh, I'm good. What are you saying? You should hook up the lights to your bike. I asked about that earlier. Huh? Always thinking. I said we should get our smoothie bike little generator bits, hook it up to your electricity and blow the rest of the world up probably because I wired it on backwards. Maybe after lockdown I'll get proper electricity in. Ready? Okay, let's go, sprint hard. Let's go. Last one. Let's go, 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 go. Ah. Good, come on, 15 left. Last 10. Last five. Let's go. Two. One. Back it up. Whoa. Should we do one more? Nah. That's enough. That's enough. But we have surprises, don't we? Should we do a little surprise? I'm hearing, yeah. I'm hearing, in one more minute, let's chuck in a couple of standing efforts. Let's just go crazy. It's not on my sheet, but hey, let's do it. In fact, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do 15 seconds standing. 15 seconds rest, 15 seconds sprint, 15 seconds rest, times three. <laughs> yes, Marco, you know you love it. Right, so in 30 seconds, we're going 15 seconds sprint, and then 15 seconds standing, times three. I haven't got any tape, so you have to remind me. Okay? Right, in 10 seconds. I'm standing, sprinting. Only 15, ready? Right, so I'm going to do them both in the big gear. Down. Let's do it. Right, let's go. Standing. Hard, hard, hard. Oh. Yeah. This is super painful. Good job. What are we on? 15, good. Right. Good job. Ready for the sprint? Five, two, one, go. Sprint. Go, go, go. That's halfway. Go. Right. Rest. Have a drink. Ready to stand. Oh my goodness. Three, two, one, go. If you need to miss it out, just miss it out, don't worry. Good. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sit down. Oh, drop it again. That's killing me. Oh, that long day's catching up now. Ready? Three, two, one, go. It's the second one, we've only got one more. Let's do it. Come on, come on, come on. That's five, two, one, good. Oh, disgustingly sweaty. Oh yeah. Right, one more if you've got it in ya. Five, three, two, 
Let's go. 15 seconds. Hard. Two, one, sit down, ease it off again. Last effort, I promise you. 15 second sprint, and then we're done. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. 15 seconds, that's all. Go, 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 go. Whoa! Right, that's 10. Come on, that's five. Power, power, power. Tour de France, jumps and knees, let's go. Whoa. Knees up. Good job, gang. Good job. That's 40, that's 36 minutes. Let's spin for five. Whoa. Pardon me. Oh. Uh, fun times. That's why it was called the asylum. <clears throat> I was going to call it Massets. There was all sorts. I got a load of criticism last night that nobody knew what the target references I was using were. So I thought I'd keep it simple. Okay, so if you managed all of that, well done. If you only managed half of that, well done. If you've learned where your limits are at the moment and you're just spinning through the hard bits, or you're taking extra rests, well done. Doesn't matter. That's why we're here, just to keep you going. As much to give you someone to, I say talk to, listen to, and keep you mentally sane at this strangest of all strange times. So yeah. What did we learn tonight? We may have the makings of a semi-professional cycling team going on. We also have the start of a worldwide cycling revolution, cyclings of an S.co.uk. If you know someone who's a school head teacher, send it to them, get them involved, get their kids working on their gross motor skills, the characteristics of effective learning, get them working on their pen control, their social skills, their balance, all these other skills which in the trade are called soft skills. And I actually think that they're not soft skills at all. I think they're the most important ones, or as important as the learning at that stage. What we're doing by using bikes is facilitating that learning, making it so that kids feel like they're in a position where they want to learn, where they can learn. <sighs> Sometimes just being out on your bike, as you guys know, just clears your head, gives you some space, gives you a breather. And then when you go back in to do your work again, it just feels easy, it just feels like it makes more sense. Kids are no different, exactly the same. And that's what cycling is about. So, yeah, if you know any teachers, send them the, send them the web address, or just send them my details and say, get in touch. And Mark will talk at you for half an hour and tell you how awesome it is. Cool. So yeah, thanks guys. Thanks for doing the uh, NHS clap if you joined in. If uh, if you know anyone who's out there working in the shops or working on the NHS, maybe drop a little line, tell them they're a legend. If you don't know anyone who works in those, maybe drop your friends a line, tell them they're legends, just because they're legends. If you enjoyed this, drop me a line, tell me I'm a legend. Oh, blimey, it's tough that one. Right, so yeah, as always, go and get yourself a drink. Go and get yourself some food. 20 to 25 grams of protein is what we can take in one sitting generally, so that's what you're aiming for. If you're going to jump in the bath, make sure it's not too hot, not too cold, because you'll carry on burning calories. If you are going to do that, make sure that you take a drink with you. If you are jumping off now, if you don't need to do any more, just go maybe do some stretching, get on the foam roller. If you do need to do an extra five minutes just to cool down a bit while your legs are flushing out, that's great. We're going to do one more minute together and then I'm going to sign off and leave you. I love you and leave you. Um, hope you enjoyed it. 
please let me know. Please let your friends know. I'll be honest with you, it's lovely to have you guys on board. That would be even lovelier to have a few more, just so we can share some more stories, share some more bands, get more people moving. So, yeah, if you know anyone else who might want to get involved, tell them that it's really easy. Tell them that the guy running the session isn't crazy. You know, and then once we've got them on the hook, then we can smash them. <laughs> just tell them they can take it easy in the hard bit. Same as I keep saying to you, top session, mate. First time over, 160 beats per minute. Good job, dude. That is impressive. Marco over there in France. Always nice to have you. Guy, all the other guys who were with me tonight, thank you for making it another top session. I love you all. Peace out. Arrivederci. And I will see you for our last session of the week tomorrow.